Jewish community leaders and elected officials are outraged after the New York Post controversial coverage of a man's murder. News 12's Ali Wolf is at Borough Hall in downtown Brooklyn with more on the backlash. That's right, and this is the cover of the post that has so many here in the community fired up. It says, who didn't want him dead next to a picture of Menachem Stark? This afternoon, elected officials and Jewish community leaders filled Borough Hall to demand the paper apologize to the Stark family and pull the story. Saturday, Nassau County police found the 39-year-old ultra-Orthodox man's body in a dumpster at a Great Neck gas station. This after someone kidnapped the father of eight from his workplace in Williamsburg Saturday night. This morning's New York Post article called Stark a, quote, crooked slumlord, and that sparked outrage from Brooklyn Jewish leaders and elected officials. In America, if you are a bad landlord, you go to housing court, not the mall. None of the tenants would say that I would have killed him. No, they would have not have killed him. And today, Jewish community leaders announced an $11,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest or conviction in this case. In the meantime, the NYPD and the Nassau County Police Department are working together to find the suspects. From Borough Hall, Allie Wolf, News 12, Brooklyn.